everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Backyard Bandits. So the timeline has advanced uh, a fair, well not a fair bit, but a, a, a quite a bit since the last episode. Uh, we've moved planets. Let's go to nav navigation real quick. I'll show you where we are. So we jumped out of the Oregon Coalition space. We were at Itrum. We jumped over here. It's still controlled by the uh, Oregon Coalition. So we're... Um, going to hopefully be helping them out here so uh, that's why we jumped here it's, it's a four and a half skull planet lots of good missions here right now and as you can see up here we do need the sea bills uh, I went ahead and put together a couple things here let's go to the uh, the mech bay real quick so a couple minor changes the battle master I did try and refit this guy a little bit um, I didn't change the weapon loadout on it uh, I, like I said I still haven't had a chance to read people's comments um, from the last few episodes so that hasn't changed but it did put the advanced zoom mark one on um, which came out of one of the mechs in the third lance that we kind of flushed out um, and I added the uh, range finder which gives us 60 base sight distance and one gunnery so I'm hoping that helps increase the targeting for this thing um, I, I don't know we're gonna try that out hopefully that works a little better uh, I still think it's under power maybe it is a pair of large VSPLs we need to put in here I don't know but I'll let you guys uh, give me some comments and see what you think. And then uh, I loaded out the longbow. I managed to get this thing loaded up and running. Now this guy, um, I wanted as a replacement for the avatar. So right now it doesn't have the correct ammo in it, but it's got enough ammo. It's an LRM-60 boat right now. Uh, once the avatar gets um, turned into a fire support mech, um, I'll be pulling out the uh, arrow ammo, putting it in here, replacing the LK. Um, I want to try out the swarm on this, and I'm going to try out some th some thunder. I've got chaff ammo in here, and a ton of dead fire, just in case we get people coming close to us, we can use that on them. But we're going to run this guy and see how it goes. Now we do have tactics support B in here for plus one tactics, also the SLDF cockpit for one tactics, and an additional piloting, which is good because this thing has got an ultralight gyro. So it takes additional stability damage. I'm hoping that this will raise the piloting on it, whoever's piloting it. Most most likely it's going to be Hopper piloting this mech, but it'll raise his piloting a little bit to help with, hopefully, re reduce the stability damage a bit. Uh, and then recon sensors, which will get changed out for better sensors later on uh, once we get some, once I'm, I figure out whether we're going to leave the uh, tracker sensors on the avatar or not. Uh, we might throw them in here, but we'll see. So yeah, that's, I left the stealth system in, um, and I had to put an exchanger in, only because we've got an integrated laser AMS, and the heat sinking is actually pretty good on this, 6951. Uh, it's a little much with this exchanger, but this thing um, can be put on overload, and it can actually fire at um, uh, incoming missiles for teammates. So uh, I'll probably end up putting this thing on overload, and it'll be generating a fair bit of heat per turn, so that extra gap that we've got here, which is what, 18, uh, will probably be eaten up by the, by the uh, AMS. Uh, it's only got a 300 core in it, unfortunately. I left the uh, pirate engine in it, just in case we need that burst of speed, great, but more so for the minus 15% engine weight factor change. Uh, so we'll leave that for now. Um, I don't think we're gonna need to use the run jump distance thing if we at all but if we have to try to escape or get behind behind something if someone's targeting us we can certainly try and do that okay so that's this guy that's about it oh I did add armor to this one too uh, so that's it so we're gonna run the main lance today uh, if we go to engineering we're making out really well here so far so we can drop a full mech now an extra mech with the uh, leopard we've got control of it with this and I've added added 50 tons to our drop tonnage, so I, I, I don't think we needed that, but I added it just in case so we can drop a bunch of heavy mechs if we need to. So we can drop two lances of five now um, per, I guess, day. If we're going to do two missions a day, we can do that. And then hopefully, like, once we get some more money, it's, once we get our finances up for, for this, we're going to st go straight into the next... Uh, uh, additional mech so and that's a little bit more that's like 600,000 and then controls like 350,000 and then the drop weight 215 so about another well not, not a million but close to a million for that so if we can get two and a half million uh, we should be good good to go now we should be able to pull that off in 20 days I think unless we take a devastating uh, mission but um, 
or a, a, you know, a devastating hit in the mission, but we got plenty of missions here. I was worried that when we got here uh, with Capella and um, um, Davian actually being on the planet, I thought there was going to be a bunch of missions for them, but as it turns out, it's mostly for uh, the Oregon Coalition, pirates, or the local government, which is great. So we're going to go right to the end here, and we're going to take Breakthrough on the Brink. It is a defend base mission, so I think we'll probably be just fine with this against the Torian Concordat. Good chance for salvage too. Uh, good payout and good salvage bonus. We should have be able to drop five uh, pilots in this one. So we're going to go full salvage. Torians already hate us, so uh, you know, I don't really care. All right, so uh, so main lance. We're going to pull out this, and we're going to put this guy in. And then I think we can just switch over. Can we not? There we go, Lance 2. There we are. Beautiful. And we'll bring um, the Battlemaster. And I'm going to bring... A, where are you? Earthquake. Um, I'm going to bring him in for this mission. Well, you know what? We need him in the other Lance, so let's leave him out. Uh, let's bring Squire with us. Let's let him pilot the... Well, yeah, let's let him pilot the Battlemaster. It's weird that... I don't know why these don't work. That's fine though. Alright, let's deploy these two lances and get it done. Alright, here we go. So these are the guys approaching. That looks like an awesome. Yeah, I have no idea what that is. Find out soon enough. We got two vehicles coming in and no other defenders except for the turrets. So defensive options. So if this happens the same way as before we played this map, the uh, enemies will drop here and up here, but you never know, right? It could be anywhere. All right, got the longbow up. Let's make sure we've got. Uh, Put that on overload, so we're protecting everybody. Um, do we want to reserve? Oh, we got it. Where's our fifth pilot? That's bizarre. Let's get. Um, let's get over here. I'm moving. I hate the fact that this first turn we don't have any options to fire here. It's annoying. Uh, where do I want you? Well, let's create a firing line. We'll go. No sensors on. All right. That's all right. Let's get the battle master right here. Piece of cake. All right. Let's see how we do. One turn to free money, but no salvage, which sucks. Still nothing, eh? Awaiting orders. Let's go find these effers. Lifting off. There they are. So it kind of makes me wish I had. Uh, Shoot, I can't even shoot at these guys. So what do we got here? A Corsair. Oof, that's a lot of stuff. Charger. Which, that guy should go down hard, I think. A Zeus. That's interesting. I think we've got, like, a Command Zeus. I think we've got pieces. I know we've got Stalker pieces. I think we got one. Alright, we need to move to positions here. Aye, aye. I get you on the move. All right. Coordinates received. I don't think we're pulling all these guys down in ten turns, especially when the reinforcements arrive. All right, here we go. Round three. Um. This is weird. Who's going first here? Oh, that's interesting. Does this change? Oh, that changes lances. That's okay. 
All right, that's kind of interesting, I guess. A little confusing, but... That's the charger. What do we want to go after here? The Zeus, probably? Uh, AC5, large laser. Uh, yeah, let's sensor lock the Zeus. Don't think it matters, but... Let's see what our targeting is like on these guys. Forty-two. Fifty-five on the Corsair. That's a lot of AMS, man. Two AC5s, large PPC, probably two mediums. Yeah, this guy's a waste of time right now. Um He's got a ton of AM. Let's just go after this guy. We can use our Apollos. We don't have incendiary, do we? No, we don't have anything but Apollo. That's fine. I know he's useless, but we got to shoot him. Got to start. Here we go. Here's our turrets. All right. Okay, you keep his attention, buddy. My laser AMS out of range? Guess it is. Yes, Commander. All right, let's give it to this guy. Copy that. Okay, I'm going to not be jumping um, away from these guys. I'm going to keep him in my sights the whole time as long as we're shooting at them. Crap. Keeping these bases from dying is going to be really hard. Ready to get it on. It's all going to depend on where our enemies drop. Yeah, we're still at really good range here. It's going to be Stalker, I think. Yeah, let's go after the Stalker. Marginally better with the X-Pulses, but let's let's hold off in this till we know we got a better shot with it. Let's fire. Yeah, nothing. Now we've only got LK on this, which is unfortunate. Now, um, how much leg armor does this guy have? 120. Like, let's go this route and see if we can get some back on this guy. He's only got really light back armor. See if we can get some back damage on him. Here we go. If we do, then Queen B can capitalize and kill this guy. We get some damage in the back? I don't know. I can't tell. We're going to lose this turret fast. 33, 30. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, I don't know, man. Yeah? Yeah. Can't move out too far, unfortunately. Wow, what a difference. What a huge difference. Maybe it is a double VSPL loadout. That's the one thing that we're missing r ridiculously bad in the... Um, the longbow is the targeting. I'll probably pull the stealth out. Beautiful. And put a, the targeting computer in. Good. One down. 
should be able to clean that guy up. Well, at least our allies can hit. I've got eyes on hostile reinforcements. Of course they are. Yeah, one there, one behind us. They're gonna cream the buildings, man. We got an awesome. Look at this. Oh man, we're dead. Okay, difficulty's gone up significantly. This is we should have two lances for this. We'll make do though. We'll make do somehow. So that's an a Zeus XR, awesome. Trebuchet, which is bad. Ebon Jaguar, which is bad. Everything is bad. Stinger, okay, not so worried about the Stinger. Corsair, Crab, and a Devastator. Um. Okay. Yes, Commander. <sighs> All right, let's focus on this Zeus this turn. I don't know if he's really that much of a threat though. The LRM is bad, but we've got worse, way worse chance of hits on these guys. The fact that we didn't get any allies dropping with us too is bad. Alright, this is fire on this guy. This is when you really see the lack of multi-target as being an issue. Now well, there goes one of our turrets. Reporting heavy damage. The longbow is the liability right now because it just doesn't have the ability to, to shoot like copper needs to be shooting. The lack of the Artemis ammo is huge. Come on, kill that guy. I don't want to have to do it. Ooh, we're gonna have no allies left. Alright, let's try and tie up as many guys as we can. Let's move over this way a bit. Uh, let's go full sprint. Try and get up as... Well, maybe not too close to each other. It's probably be bad. Walk it over to here. We're gonna use some swarm... ...on these guys here. Uh, swarm is supposed to be better with... Uh, Lower chances to hit, from what I understand. Maybe not. Yeah, see? All those ones, man, I would prefer be using direct fire and just hammering one area. Okay. Especially in a fight like this. Uh, let's Vigilance first. Don't know how good these guys are. Don't know how good these guys are, and I would rather have this awesome not shooting at the uh, building, so let's just shoot at him, him, him in the back. Wow, we missed. Oh, we got one, okay. Maybe he'll turn and shoot at me, but it's unlikely. 
Yeah, crap. That's gone. No, it's not. What do you know? Ready for orders. Christ, you're in a bad spot. Well, you gotta take these guys on. Because we're still at long range, that's why. Well, let's see if we can get it. We're going to Warlord it. Nope. Damn. Well, I'm going to chalk this match up to a learning experience anyway. Yeah, targeting computer makes all the difference, eh? Plus his like line of like his range for seeing things. Nope. Um five point two percent for the head. Forty percent for the leg. Round four, huh? Let's see if we can kill this guy. Critical hit, Commander. Well, if even if we didn't kill him, at least it, it's going to give an oh crap, going to give an opportunity for our allies to do so. Losing armor left and right here. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, a lot of damage to the CT. Core crit. Beautiful. So I thought I, I thought about going double arrows with the um, with the longbow, and I did try it out, but it was basically, you know, two arrows and three tons of ammo for each, and that was it. I couldn't get anything else in there. <laughs> it was so bad. Commander. Now, if I'm correct, this guy's got self self healing armor, so there's no point in shooting at him. We do need awesome parts, so let's go after the awesome. If we do manage to survive this, got the angle, taking the shot. Let's not jump into the barrage again, because that's just wrong. Roger that. Okay. Wondering if acid ammo is going to become in come in a lot more handy later on. Like a full dose of acid from an LRM, if there is acid ammo for LRMs. Hit a mech with it, maybe hit it 30 times or something, increase the damage by 30% and then just hammer it with everybody else.
You hit your own guy. So round five. We're so th at the end of this round, we're halfway there. Hang in there, buddy. Don't bail. Don't bail out. Yes, Commander. Okay, you really have to engage this side, I think. There we go. Better chance with the snub. Here it comes. Beautiful shot. Leg hit. If you can pull one of his legs, he's pretty much useless for the rest of the fight. Battlemaster's going to rotate over to take these guys on. Yeah, the laser AMS for some reason. It's on overload, but it's not protecting everybody. Um, did I accidentally double hit it? Talk to me. Was it turned off? No, it's on. Overload. Right? Should be working. Copy that. Well, Swarm is not really working like I would hoped. Maybe we can get some... I don't know. Fuck this. LK is useless. Without the targeting computer, this thing's useless. Let's go Thunder Advanced. Or Thunder Augmented. Alright. Um, let's drop it in there. So the augmented does less damage per mine, but it has a greater chance of the mine being triggered. So I'm wondering if that was what was being used in a lot of the... Uh, in that last... in the match where our uh, ally was using mines. Awaiting orders. Okay, these guys up here are targeting the building, so... see if we can get some shots on them. So the Devastator or the Corsair? Too ballistic. We're not going to get a kill on any of these guys. Just got to keep them tied up. Cauldron Born. Devastator. Let's fire on this guy. Nice. It might just keep him off us. Okay. Keep shooting the turrets. What's up, Commander? Let's stay on this guy. For an alpha oh yeah. Report critical hit. Nice shot. Did he hit his own guy in the back? Looked like it might have. He might have. Useless. Okay, maybe not. Nice shot. For some reason those guys are inspired. Fuck off.
Okay, whose AMS is that? Is that mine? I think that was the awesome. My AMS must be going off. If we're in a cold environment and I've got this much heat, it's got to be going off every turn. Maybe it's just not being seen. Because it... I don't think they've got an AMS turret back here. Do they? I can't see how much damage those guys are taking in their legs, if anything. Okay, it looked like 12 there for one leg. Reporting. Shoot me up a crab, will ya? Shut this guy up a bit if we can. Alright, all you need is one hit. Nice shot. See if we can get him to target you instead. Friendly structure down. They've still got a chance to kill two more though. I've got your back. Let's cool off. Let's give these guys another minefield. We've only got one more turn of the augmented, but we'll drop it on these guys. Like Ah, uh, seven damage in the legs, eight damage in the leg. It's almost completely useless. Engaging target. LRMs are out. Ready for orders. Oof. Moving to position. Charger is Zeus. Zeus is more dangerous, so let's go after this guy. Beautiful. Enemy down. Well, there's at least two mech pieces now. Standing by. Okay, don't jump into the minefield. Wow, that minefield is huge. Engaging jump jet. Let's just shoot up this guy's backside. Let's hope we get some more hits in the back here, but I don't know. Enemy oh yeah, a couple hits. Pain. I think we hit this guy too. Nice, we'll get another turn to shoot at him and jump away. Fuck off. Shoot that Devastator somebody. I think we'll turn the Battlemaster. At least that... Okay, I, I shouldn't jinx it. I was about to say, at least that awesome is useless, but... Yeah, he's in a good position now. He's taking a lot of back damage, though. Alright, he took a little bit more that time in mines, but not much more. I'm gonna... I, I don't know. I, I think I'm just gonna leave the uh, mines off. Yeah. What can I do you for? Unless somebody can convince me otherwise, they, they just don't seem to be doing anything. It's a chance to hit the... Wow. We don't even have range on them. Don't want to have range on anybody. That's the trick with these VSPLs, though. Like, great damage, but if we don't have speed to get in close, what's the point? Well, we don't have the ability to see anybody else. That's what the problem is. Crap. I thought we could see the other guys, but... All right. I'll make them set. Got to take the best chance to hit. All right, all right, I miss. Yeah, no. This guy's surviving pretty well. He's panicking though, which means he's gonna bail. Okay, that was a good hit. 
Eh. All right. Queen B on 23. As long as you're shooting the turrets, it's okay. It's just okay. Okay, he looked like he took 24. Awaiting orders. Let's go after this guy. Target lock on enemy's rear. Well, at least he's walking into the barrage. Target's taking a critical hit. Could have been worse, and she could have missed, and the barrage could have gone off like right at uh, our base. We may have to fly her up to the uh, hill here, so let's move into here. We may have to fly up the hill there. Stop. That building's almost gone. Don't bail out. All right. Talk to me. All right. Since he's back damage. Good burn. See what we can do with this. Looked like a couple points maybe to the back. I don't know, let's see. We'll find out. Yeah, a couple points here and there. Orders. Now let's get Arachne going. Uh, he's at a range. Crap. All right, let's put the sensors on. Oh, everybody's at a range. Yeah, everybody's at a range. All right. All right, let's shoot this guy. Wait, what's this guy doing here? That's the Corsair. Now I think it's this guy that's been doing the most damage. Let's fire at him. Wilco. Nothing. <sighs> Holding their turret. Okay, he should probably be able to take this these two guys out by himself. Let's just hammer this guy. Inflicted some heavy damage. Oh, he's only unsettled, huh? Thought I were shaking him a little more. Come on, buddy, improve your uh Prove your status. Crap, there goes the second one. Third one's not far behind. Look at that. It's the antenna going way up in the air. As much as I want to try and kill this awesome. Oh. I'm thinking we may have to jump up to the hill. Those guys are doing the most damage to buildings. Oh, either that or we switch the longbow up there. Which maybe we should. Ready for order. Location confirmed. 
This one's a tricky one. If they just wanted to, if they just targeted all the buildings, we'd be in serious trouble. But we're kind of getting lucky with this. I think it's going to end up being the awesome with this guy. Yeah. Awesome it is. Alright, one hit. Screw up his sensors a little bit. At least he's in the barrage area too, which is good. I don't think I can get behind him. Safely, that is. Oof, nice shot. Ooh, finally the Thunderbolt hit. Round eight. Three left. Shit. Well, that's what you get for hitting the awesome with the Thunderbolt, but at least you hit him before you died. Fuck. What's he using? Who was that? Was that the Black Knight that was shooting, or was I think it was? Yes, Commander. How far can we get up here? Not far enough. Damn. Confirm. Let's get into here. Vigilance, so hopefully we get initiative next turn. Should be able to target this guy in the back. Beautiful. And that's a really great chance to hit. I wonder if we should offensive push this guy and go for a torso. Let's see what our chances are with that. That's not that bad. Firing at enemies. Oof, almost. Wow, that was way off. At least you're shooting at that guy, though. Fucking stop shooting the buildings! I've only got a couple rounds left. I don't know how I'm going to split my fire between all these guys. Watch my six. Pew pew. Get our stability back, Warlord. What's up, buddy? There goes the leg. He's going down. Reporting critical hit. Might be able to take that other leg next turn. Once we get that second Black Knight in the battle, too, that's going to be crazy. Stop shooting the buildings! What the hell was that? Did you guys see that? Something flew away the hell over here. Hopper, you gotta get on these guys, man. Okay, at least he's shooting turrets. How can I help? Guys up on the hill, please. Roger. Okay, you got swarms, so let's hit both of these guys. Can 
Can you get that course, the Devastator? Barely. Um, it's a little closer. God damn it. Just out of range, too. Let's, uh... Let's lock the crab. Can we get a kill on this guy? Maybe, if we get lucky. I'm not going to target that leg, I'm just going to fire. I'm going to do as much damage to him as I can. Oh, we hit the guy behind him too, that's good. Good to go. Try to close the distance to get all our weapons on these guys. We could go after the Zeus. It's the Evan Jaguar though. Where is he? And the trebuchet. 30, 30, 24, 24. 24 in the crab. The crab, I think, hopefully will fire on somebody else. We're not hitting this guy. I mean, we could punish the awesome. But we got to shoot at somebody that's shooting the, uh, potentially shooting the building. So let's go after this guy. Did we hit our own guy twice? Losing armor. Fuck. Really? What did the awesome lose? Torso, beautiful. I'm kind of glad I did go after that back piece now. Christ. We're not going to pull this off. Trying to keep you alive, buddy. Okay, took more landmine damage. Won't matter, though. Commander. Okay, let's see if we can distract this guy. Good chances to hit, too. Firing at enemies. <sighs> Hopefully he'll try and do something other than shoot at buildings. Okay, more mine damage. Beautiful. Hopefully. I guess that mine damage works if they're like constantly moving back and forth through the area. So if you've got a missile mech, I guess, that's just standing back and firing, that might work because they may just end up killing themselves walking back and forth across mines, but I don't know. In a short battle like this, it might not even be worth it. Fuck, he just got it. No? It's kind of shocking. 
It's just going to take one more hit. That's all it's going to take. I've got your back. Roger that. This guy's just pot shotting buildings. Ooh. It's not bad. Let's just. Sh um. Let's put 40 incendiary on him. Because maybe we can set something off in that torso. And then let's drop some chaff on him and some swarm. And see how we do here. Nothing. Hopefully he shoots back at me. Okay, let's um, do this. Like that. that. Because when we do a an offensive push on this guy against his leg, it'll be a better chance to hit. Uh. Nope. Fuck. Nice try though. At least he's tied up. This guy's only choice is to attack the building, so let's go after him. Don't think we got that leg. Oh, we did. Okay. We're not getting enough kills to get good salvage out of this, but at least we'll survive and make some good sea builds, hopefully. I don't know. Yeah, I want this, um, I want to get an awesome piece, so if you could get close and shoot that awesome, I would really appreciate it. All right, I'll give him the whole nine, yeah. Got one more round after this. We're going to jump in, attack him. I think I might, ooh, beautiful, oh, we couldn't get any better than that. So we should be able to pull this Corsair down, I think. He's taking the barrage here in a second. We'll see how much damage it takes. Alright, a lot of internal structure damage there, which is nice. What the hell are those things? Fuck. This is the last round, guys. I'm on pins and needles right now. Yep, shoot those guys every time. Just shoot at that guy. Please. Alright, who do we got running here? Queen Bee. Uh, I'm gonna... Oh, Christ. Is there anywhere we can get a kill on anybody? I don't think so. Maybe we can try and shut this guy the hell up. Got the angle. Taking the shot. Look at those spikes on the back of it. The 
get a gangle of it. I don't know. Would you rather be a charger part uh, pilot? Receiving you. Or would you rather be something useful? Did this crab die? No, he's still there. I mean, we could try and go for sell. I, I don't know. I think we just need to tie these guys up. I think we just need to shoot these guys. Keep them tied up. Keep them not shooting at people. He's already gone, though. 21. I have no idea what this guy's initiative was, but we're going to fire on him. It's like a torso hit to me. A few more torso hits. Inflicted some heavy damage. Okay, who do we got left? We got Hopper. Before this longbow goes back into battle, it's got to be re-outfitted from the Avatar. Because it's pretty much—it's been pretty much useless this, this battle. Okay, Devastated decided to shoot at her. Exactly what I was hoping for. So the Trebuchet and the Ebon Jaguar, I'm going to hit them both with Swarm. Oh, he's moving. Oh, he's decided to uh, run away. Talk to me. So let's go two swarm and two chaff. Hopefully tie him up. Gonna warlord this. He already went in 25 though. Who hasn't gone yet? Oh my god, did we actually pull this off? Um, do we just try and so let's just try and swarm leg this guy. Maybe he'll maybe he'll bail out if we take the leg. Not enough. Receiving you. Confirm. Let's try for the leg. Right leg, torso, right arm, whole side blown off. Whatever. Target. At least he's dead. <sighs> Who's left? Oh, there was somebody left. I thought he went on 25. Or 21, whatever it was. Oh, the crab stood up. That was what it was. Oh, well, that would make sense. So he's gone now. Well, we have a chance to kill here. You know what? On my way. I better not shoot for that guy. I was thinking about trying for a headshot on him, but I don't want to hit my own guy again. It's going to be a lot of damage if I do hit him. Fire at all yeah, no biggie. Oh, he got knocked down. There it is. Oh my god, we did it. Mission <laughs> now, I did not think there would be any way we could pull that off, but we didn't get all the buildings. Okay, we lost 25%, no big deal, but gained 10% there, so that should cover our damage. We, we did take a, a bit of damage, but not too much. Good XP, though. Alright. 
So, well, there's an awesome if you want it. I don't, I don't think there's, I mean, why wouldn't we take it? I mean, we could take the stalker parts and have a stalker. Laser and bullet and missile. This guy's almost all laser. Trebuchet parts. Oh, we did get the, we did kill a trebuchet. He must have bailed. There's the Zeus part too. Now we don't have enough to make a Zeus though. What else do we take? Is there any clan gear down here? Highly unlikely. 285 core, that would be nice. An XL engine for C-bills would probably be the best way to go. Regular, lots of heat sinks, double heat sinks. We got double heat sink kits. So we're okay there. AMS ammo we're currently okay for. So, I mean, let's just take this and sell it. I mean, we need the C-bills bad. All right, we got a trebuchet part. AC-5 can go. LRM-10 can go. Basic cockpits can go. And we got lots of endo-steel, right? We got, yeah, we got seven. That can go. 240 co core can go. The 250 can go. The 255 can go. We're going to hang on to that one. We're going to sell this. Sell these heat sinks. Look at that. C-bills, man. Juicy. We'll hang on to the AMS ammo. It's always useful. LRM can go. Well, hang on to the double heat sinks too. How many do we have? We got 13. Let's just ditch these then. 195. Beautiful. 1.6 million now. Yeah, 76,000. That's not too bad and only nine days for repairs. Which I think will end up being less, will it not? Yeah. It's only six days for repairs. Beautiful. So, yeah. Yep, the Battlemaster did better. Not quite as hard to hit, which was nice to see, but we do we definitely need to get those um those um advanced like the advanced zooms, like the advanced targeting computers onto the longbow. Take get take them off the avatar for now, put them on the longbow. Probably lose heat sinking that way. I don't know what we're gonna lose. We'll I'll have to figure something out. Um but that's probably the way we're going to end up going. And then I'll work on a loadout for the Avatar. Probably a close support mech. More along the lines of um, the Bushwhackers. Nice heavy close-in punch, I think, is what we're going to we'll use it for. Um, and maybe get a bit of the advanced uh, electronic warfare suite or something. Not sure yet, but that's going to be most likely the, the, the fast mech for, um, for my uh, main lance. But I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. We got over 2 million now, which is awesome. So we can make our financial report. Did that in one mission. That's awesome. Um, and then, uh, so everything else we get now is gravy. Hopefully by the end of this month, we'll be able to have six mechs per, per drop, which is excellent. So now we're going to have to find out what is the extra mech we're going to bring forward. Oh, yeah. Let's uh, Before we finish, let's go to the mech bay. Bring that awesome forward. Maybe that's Maybe it will be the awesome. Oops, storage. Uh, assault. Awesome. See what it's got in it. Now, obviously, our sea bills per month are going to go up, but let's have a quick look and see. It looks like it, it looks like a lot survived. So maybe this becomes the PPC build. It's got battle fists. Melee accuracy? Why would you put that on an awesome? Standard cockpit, like... Yeah, we lost the CT, which is shitty, but still. How much is it to repair this thing? 600,000. A little too rich right now. But this could be the PPC build. And the Battlemaster could switch to a, a VSPL build. I think probably that's the best way to go. Because these are what? How much heat are these? 30. We could put a snub on this arm. I don't know. Exchanger. Why does this thing have battle fists? Like, I mean, come on, guys.
really it doesn't even have hand actuators so why would you like <sighs> all right well we'll figure out what we'll do with this guy afterwards but i think this guy will be the ppc boat and the battle mastery change to the uh vspl build i think but we'll figure that out later all right i'm going to end this episode guys i hope you enjoyed it um, if you did drop a like, if you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.